guys, so today I'm going to do something that I haven't done on this channel before and that is talk about a product that I think you should not buy. It's a product that I had a bad experience with and I just felt compelled to share that with you guys. The product I am talking about is the Garnier Fructis Fortifying Sleek and Shine Shampoo and Conditioner Set. This is what they look like. As you can see, I have huge bottles of them. My mom bought these and we've been regretting it ever since. We're a fan of the Garnier shampoo and conditioners usually, so I mean this is, I've seen commercials for this, this must be one of the newer ones that, the newer lines that has come out, but my mom and I both hated them. And you can see we used about this much of both the shampoo and conditioner and we just couldn't use it anymore because it was that bad. Basically the gripe that I had with it was when you wash your hair with that shampoo, it doesn't clean your hair like at all, it doesn't suds up, um, it doesn't feel clean. I would wash my hair twice with it in order to get a little bit of bubbles and feel like it had cleaned my hair a little and then I'd follow it up with the conditioner and the conditioner really didn't do much except make your hair really weighed down and just greasy feeling and I'm thinking that those both of them, the shampoo and the conditioner, have to be just like loaded with silicones because my hair can usually deal with silicones, it's not usually a big deal because I have dry hair and kind of frizzy hair and curly hair, so my hair likes silicones, it kind of likes to be coated, it helps with frizz, whatever, but I have never had a shampoo that made my hair as gross feeling as that shampoo. So I dealt with it for a little while and probably used it for maybe three weeks to a month time and then I just couldn't deal with it anymore. I'm like, mom, we need to get new shampoo and a conditioner, I cannot deal with it like anymore. Because because my hair was getting dirty on the second day, like the first, even the first day it didn't look that great and then the second day my hair was dirty and I'd have to wash it again and usually like, I don't know if this is gross, but usually I can go like three days without washing my hair because it's dry so I never had that problem before so it was very strange that I was having that problem. So then my mom was like, yeah, I hate that shampoo too. So we went back to what we've been using before which I really, really love this Garnier line which is the Color Shield line. And I think I've talked about this on here before. So we have the Fortifying Shampoo Color Shield and the Fortifying Conditioner Color Shield and they come in the red bottles. And especially this conditioner I absolutely love. The shampoo is like a, a moisturizing shampoo which is good for my hair normally. They're both good. I, I definitely recommend both of these and it's the same brand, it's just not the Sleek and Shine line. So we went back to these and even when I went back to this normal routine that I had been using before, my hair was still feeling weird. Like it was feeling kind of like grungy, like weighed down and like I still had like gunk in my hair from the sleek and shine stuff. So a couple of days ago I was like, you know what, enough is enough. I need to get some kind of a clarifying shampoo or something because that other shampoo and conditioner messed up my hair so much that it just doesn't even feel like my hair normally does anymore. So I went to Target and I bought the Aveeno Active Naturals Pure Renewal Shampoo because I had heard good things about this being a good clarifying shampoo. So I used this yesterday in the shower. Um, this is day two hair on me and as you can see like day two my hair is fine like it doesn't look greasy I have dry hair so yes this actually worked yesterday when I did my hair after I got out of the shower it was the first time I felt like I had my hair back like it was behaving the way that it normally did before I started using that sleek and shine line so yeah if you see these don't pick them up <laughs> especially if you have any kind of like greasy hair or just not super dry hair because I have dry hair and it weighed down even my hair which is just, I don't know, it's it's wrong. It's wrong Garnier, I don't know what is in this but yeah definitely don't get these huge things of it because we don't even know if these are ever going to get used because they're just bad, like bad and I'm a fan of Garnier too but bad. Oh, by the way guys, if you are subscribed to me on Leviosa, you've seen this already, I'm sorry that I'm saying it again, but I signed up for a new site called Sublime, and on that site I'm going to be able to list a lot of my favorite things. So I know on this channel I do a favorites, uh, not every month, please, Sarah, you don't do them every month, but sometimes I do like a monthly favorites. So those things will be up on that site, so you guys can click over there and see my favorite things. If you go over, you'll see what I mean. But I just wanted to let you guys know about it, because right now there is a giveaway going on on that site. Sublime is letting me do a giveaway, and I had to tell Beautifully Bookish about this, because one of the items that they're letting me give away is a very, um, 
beauty YouTuber kind of an item. So I wanted to let you guys know about that because the giveaway is ending tomorrow, February 15th, Friday. So I wanted you to get the chance to go over there and check out the site and also try and you know enter the giveaways and stuff. Also, I'm so sorry that I haven't done a Beautifully Bookish video in so long. I've been having like beauty YouTuber block. Like I can't think of any really good videos to do on this channel. I just don't want them to be like the videos that everyone else has already done. Unless you guys want to see that from me. Like do you want to see a what's in my purse video? Do you want to see that kind of stuff from me? The last video I did about the scarf collection, that was a suggestion from one of you guys. So if you have any other suggestions for me, I would love to hear them. Just leave them down in the comments below and I will check out those comments and definitely consider doing those videos. The Sublime site and the giveaway that I'm talking about will also be right down there in the description box. Definitely check that out and thank you so much for watching guys. I'll see you soon. Bye!